Jordan's beard. So with that breaking here, have you seen that they finally revealed Monier in Lego form today on Lego.com, which is also a Target exclusive. Let's take a look at this majestic set. Hang till the end for images of the Dark Trooper attack. Oh yeah. Let's get to it. Here it is, officially Thor's Hammer for $99.99, set 76209, released today on lego.com. It is also a Target exclusive if I didn't mention it. This is a beautiful set with some cool details. I think they did a good job with the plaque and the rock stand for the hammer to lay on for me to pick it up. Here's a good look at the box art. I think they did pretty good. Got a little bit of lightning going on. That's cool. Here's a side view of my hammer. Very symmetrical. Good for Lego. They got a little secret compartment in there where you can hide the extras from the set. Here's another one with a little lightning. Not sure how they created lightning on a Lego, but, but let's go with it. This set comes with yours truly, and this is a unique torso print for me, exclusive to this set. It also comes with that dead guy's gauntlet and all the infinity stones, plus the cosmic cube and the eternal flame. Very cool. Here is the back side of the box. Very nice detail. Very clean. And then they put a picture of a guy who's clearly not worthy. I do have one gripe, Lego. Why do you not have written on Monier, whosoever holds this hammer if he may be worthy shall possess the power of thought that is my one gripe that i feel like you should have a printed piece with that on the side of my hammer other than that i think it looks magnificent and i think that this set will do really good after retirement hello gorgeous oh i'm talking about the set we got the dark trooper attack that was released yesterday all over the internet fantastic looking set for 29.99 this will be set 75324 it comes with a nice luke skywalker in his shroud with three dark troopers the same that came with Moff Gideon's light cruiser. But if you are one to collect all the dark troopers, this is the way to go now. There are some really cool features in this set. There is an elevator door that you can rotate with the knob up top to bring Luke into the scene, into the hallway. And you can see a little slider there where if you put the dark trooper's foot on one of the studs, you can slide him straight to Luke Skywalker right as he pulls him with the force to take his head off or destroy him, whatever is the case. Really good looking box art. They got Mando and Grogu down in the bottom left. This set comes with 166 pieces and like I said, three dark troopers and a Luke. Here's another angle of the backside. You can see Luke sneaking Sneaking in that elevator. Actually, he doesn't sneak. He just walks up in that party. Here, like I said, you slide the Dark Trooper to his demise. Here's a look at the back of the box. This box is really nice. They did a good job. Here's a close look at all the characters. For $30, I think they knocked this set out of the park. I think people are going to love this, and this is going to be a hot seller after it retires. Yes, I know. Everybody's going to buy it up. But that doesn't mean that it doesn't have potential like the 501st Battle Pack. It may be a little longer. You must have patience, just like a Jedi. And there you have it. Two of the coolest sets that have been revealed for 2022. Two, thus far. Thor's Hammer, not appropriately titled, but they didn't want to pay me royalties for Monier. Totally get it. And the Dark Trooper Attack. What a phenomenal set. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. If you like this kind of content, make sure you smash that like button and subscribe to Mike's channel, Thor with Dead Breaking. I'm out.